Hey guys, what's up? My name is Flare Gun for Tutorial Cinema, and I have another Sony Vegas tutorial for you guys today. I would like to apologize again for the lack of video uploads, but uh, I just, you know, incredibly busy, not many submissions, you know how it goes. So uh, anyways, in this tutorial, I'll be showing you guys how to do a cool little echo effect and also some presets that come with the uh, audio plugin that we'll be using. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. What I'm going to go ahead and start off is use uh, create a new audio track. And then we need to hit the arm record button, or at least I do, to record my audio. Um, and I'm just going to say something random. And usually when I press this arm to record button, a place uh, will pop up in the middle to asking me where to save it. But I already did that, so when I arm to record, it's just going to go ahead and arm it. So, um, so once I do that, I can go ahead and hit the bottom record button, and it'll start recording my voice. And then uh, I can say something, and then we'll, we'll add the effect afterwards. So let's go ahead and do that. Echo! I know that wasn't really original, but I did not really feel like saying something else and embarrassing myself. So anyways, what we want to do is if you... I'm going to go ahead and unarm the tracks to make it look a little not crazy. And uh, we can either add the effect to the track itself or the, the actual uh, audio. So I'm going to right click the audio and do audio event FX. Now, what you're going to need to do is look for reverb, and I'm pretty sure this comes with all Sony Vegas's back to 7. So if you have 7 or up, you should be good. Just hit OK. Um, now this is going to bring up a bunch of cool little uh, uh, things. I mean, you're not going to mess with anything except the reverberation mode or the uh, these little sliders, the three here. Now, um, <clears throat> to get the one that, that I'm used most often, it's kind of like a custom one. What I'm going to do is I'm going to bring this down um, to about 2. I'm going to bring the middle one up to about negative 8. And I'm going to also bring this one up. And, uh, and then we'll go ahead and preview that and uh, see the echo effect that we have. Echo. Ooh, that's a little bit crazy. But we can also take a look at the uh, the presets that come with it. So uh, by default, it's rich hall, which means like it's trying to imitate the sound as if you were yelling in a deep hall. So I'll go ahead and show you the, what it is by default. Echo. So you see, it, it kind of sounds like I'm in a, a hall. You can you can mess around with all of these. Um, there's a metal tank. Um, if you're doing a war movie or something, and you record in a tank. Echo. I don't know. I mean, there, there's tons of them. Um, you guys can play around with them. Um, long haul. We'll go ahead and preview that one. Echo. Not much difference from uh, Rich Hall, but I mean, um, sounds pretty good. So just go ahead and try around with these. Uh, have fun, and uh, thanks guys for watching. I hope you learned something, and I will see you guys next time. See ya.